All right, guys, let's get started. We're gonna start with our warm up. Here we're gonna start by activating our hips, loosening them up. Just make big circles. Pretend you're stepping over something. Pick your knee up and then go over. There we go, keep going side to side. Big circular motions. There we go. Get a couple more in on each side. Perfect. All right, now we're gonna reach for those toes. Try to straighten out the leg. Reach forward. There we go. Get those hamstrings activated. Keep reaching. Looks like we have people joining us. There we go, we're just swarming up. All right, now we're just gonna go side to side. Just go side to side with our lunges. Again, staying low, warming up those knees. There we go. Keep going, just side to side. Try to stay low, get a couple more. All right, now we're gonna take a big step forward, come down into our lunge. Bring that elbow down, to get that nice hip stretch. Reach forward and then twist. It's gonna open up our hips even more when we twist, look up, then we're gonna Switch legs. Again, elbow down, reach and twist. Big lunge forward, elbow down, reach and twist. Keep going side to side. Couple more. Perfect. All right, let's go into our pump drill. So our hips are gonna go up high, push those heels down to the floor so we feel it in our calves. Then we're gonna sink our hips, squeeze the glutes. We're gonna look up, getting our abs stretched and our lower back stretched. Then we're gonna control ourselves, push yourself up, hips up high, push those heels down again. Nice and controlled, bring your hips down. Squeeze the glutes, look up. Hold it for a couple seconds. There we go. Remember to breathe. And then we're gonna pump them out, get some quick ones in, up and down. All right, guys. So we're gonna start with our warm up. We have three exercises today for our warm up. We're gonna do 20 reps of each. And we're gonna try to get as many rounds as possible, as possible in five minutes, okay? So we got 20 high knees, just nice and quick, driving those knees up. All right, then we have 20 standing crunch, okay? So we're gonna crunch to the side, we're gonna squat, and then alternate crunch to the other side. Squat, crunch, squat, crunch, okay? Notice that I am staying low on that crunch, so squat, crunch, drive that knee in. So that's our second exercise. Then our third one is a drop squat, okay? So start with your feet together, then squat, 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 okay? So we're gonna do 20 of each, and then we're gonna get as many rounds as possible in five minutes. All right, here we go, guys, just follow along. Here we go, in three, two, one, and go. 20 high knees, drive those knees up. Three, four, here we go. Drive them up, drive them up. 20 nice and quick. Once we're done, we got crunch, squat, crunch, 20. That means 10 each side. Here we go, drive that knee in, squat, 20 each side. And then we got 20 drop squats. Perfect. 20 total, 20 total. Here we go. We've got our squats. Tap and squat, tap and squat, tap and squat. 20 total, then we're gonna go back to our high knees. Remember, we're gonna get as many rounds as possible in five minutes. We should get around three or four. There we go, squat and then 
Rotate those feet, bring that knee in. Squat, rotate your knee, your feet, bring the knee in. There we go. Nice, Nicole. Remember on those squats, starting with our feet together. Squat low, tap the middle. Squat low, tap the middle. Squat low. 20, nice and quick. There we go, perfect. Nice, Haley. There we go, Mariela, perfect. Squat and drive that knee in. Let's get nice and warm, guys, nice and warm. We're halfway there already. Let's get another couple of rounds in. There we go, put some effort into that knee drive, guys. There we go, squat. Drive that knee in. The full body crunch. Full body crunch. Here we go. Nice. I see some starting their third round. Nice work, guys. Nice work. Make sure you're giving max effort on this warm up. We need to warm up those glutes, warm up those legs. Nice, Colleen. There we go, Keely. Looking good, guys. Looking good. There we go, Emily. You got it. Nice, Leslie. We go 20 quick high knees. 20 quick high knees. Then we're going to drive your knee in for a crunch squat. And then the other side. There we go. Put max effort, guys, in everything you do. You need to get, stay focused with each exercise. Have that mind-muscle connection. Remember to breathe. And we get 20, 20, 20. Final 60 seconds. Perfect, we're looking good, guys. We're looking good. Keep it up. We go squat and drive. Squat, drive that knee in. Perfect. After that, do your jump squat. Final 30 seconds. Here we go. We got it. You got it, Martha. Nice, Leslie. Nice, Haley. 15 seconds. Let's finish our warm up. Get a few more reps. Few more reps. Three, two, one, and relax. All right, guys, we're going to get straight to work now. So we have six different sections we're going to do. Each section has two exercises. We're going to do each exercise for one minute. And then we're gonna repeat that again. So two rounds, okay, of that one section. I'm just gonna show you two exercises at a time so that we can stay focused with those and get the most out of those two, okay? So our first one, guys, we have curtsy lunge with pulses, okay? So we're gonna come back. Remember the curtsy lunge, you're wrapping that foot behind. You're gonna pulse for three. So one, two, three, come back to the middle and then switch legs. One, two, three, Back to the middle, switch legs. If you have a band, go ahead and wear that band around your knees. That's gonna add a little bit more resistance, okay? Notice that I'm staying low the whole time. This is time under tension right here, okay? Keeping those glutes fully engaged for the entire minute. Number two, we are gonna do some abs, single leg crunch, okay? So legs are gonna start nice and straight and we're gonna crunch one at a time, okay? Bring that knee in, one at a time. All right, once we're done with our first round, we're gonna repeat one more time. All right, here we go, guys, here we go. Curtsy lunges. In three, two, one, and go. One, two, three. One, two, three. Keep alternating. Keep those shoulders back, chest up. Really wrap that foot around. 
we go. Your front leg should be completely down. You should push off that heel when you're coming up, keeping those glutes engaged the whole time. You want to stay low the whole time. Even when you're coming back in the middle. One, two, three. Here we go. Remember to breathe. Two, three. Wrap that foot around. One, two, three. Have that nice wide stance. Right now we're focusing on the side of our glute. Keep going guys, we got five seconds. Get a couple more, come on. All right, on our mats, single leg crunch. Legs are straight out. Then you're gonna breathe in one at a time. You can put your hands behind your head to support your neck. Bring one knee in at a time. There we go, Nicole. Yep, legs are out straight, and then you're gonna bring one knee in at a time. Heels should not be touching the floor. Here we go. Like a slow motion bicycle. So bring a knee in. Keep those legs straight out. One, one leg should always be straight out. Nice and straight, the heels without touching the floor. You got it, Nicole, good, yep. Nice, Colleen. Three, two, one. On our feet again, guys, we're gonna go into our curtsy lunges. This is our second round right here. Straight to work. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two. Three, stay low the whole time. Get that nice wide lunge, curtsy lunge. Nice and controlled, guys, nice and controlled. Keep those shoulders back, chest up. There we go. Find that balance. Stay low, stay low. We gotta feel that burn. That's how we know it's working, come on. Stay low guys, stay low. Final 10 seconds, come on. Don't come up, don't come up. One, two, three. One, two, three, center it up. One, two, three. All right, into our single leg crunch. Getting straight to work. One knee in at a time. Starting with one with both legs out and then bring one knee in. One knee in. Here we go. Don't let those heels touch the ground. Keep your legs out nice and straight. Keep that constant tension on your abs. Nice, Haley. Perfect, Marilla. Perfect form, guys. Keep it up. We got about 20 more seconds. There we go. We got it. Keep those up, those legs off the or the heels off of the floor. One at a time. One at a time. Get those final reps in, guys. Three, two. One, and relax. All right, guys, second station, second section. We got half sumo squat. So we're gonna have a sumo squat, basically a wide stance, and we want our toes pointing out, okay? Not forward, out, okay? So we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, explode up. One, two, three, four, five, explode up, okay? So we want the nice wide stance working on the inside of our thighs. Then our second one, we are gonna come down into our mats, okay? We're gonna have our hand nice and straight and then we're gonna have our bottom knee supporting us, okay? Both arms and legs are out like so and then we're gonna crunch in, okay? Out, crunch in. So we're gonna feel it in our obliques but we're also gonna feel this in our glutes and our abductors, okay? So out, crunch in, out, Crunch it. We're gonna stay on one side for one minute 
Then when I, we come back for the second round, we'll switch sides, okay? So here we go, guys. Half sumo, remember five pulses, and then explode up. Here we go in three, two, one, and go. Nice wide stance, four, five, and up. One, two, three, four, five, and up. Here we go, nice wide stance. Toes should be pointing out. Here we go. And up, but explode as high as possible. Oh yeah, we're gonna feel it on the outside of our glutes and then on the inside of our thighs. Nice wide stance, perfect. Toes pointing out. Here we go, stay low. One, two, three, four, five, explode up. Len, bring your, your, uh, your um, strap a little bit lower, so around your knee. So if you're using a band, so that way you can get a nice wide stance on these sumos. Three, two, one. All right, guys, let's go on our mats. Okay, we're on our hand, okay, on our hand. Then we have our bottom knees bent so we can support. Kick that leg out so it's not touching. Here we go, in three, Two, one, and go. We're crunching in, crunching in, crunching in. There we go. Reach and crunch in. There we go. Perfect. Stay right there, stay right there. We're looking good. Remember to breathe. Reach and crunch. Bring that knee all the way in towards your chest. We got it, we got it. Keep that arm nice and straight. That knee is supporting you down low. Perfect, Emily. Good, Martha. There we go, good, good. Bring it together. Really feel it when you're in that crunch. Have that extension, then come back. 10 seconds, guys, keep going. Three, two, one, on our feet, guys, we're gonna go back to our sumos, okay? Nice wide stance. Let's try to get a little bit lower on those sumos. Here we go, in three, two, one, and go. Nice and low for five. Explode up. One, two, three, four, five. Explode up and try to squeeze those glutes when you're exploding up. Explode up, perfect. You got it, Haley. You got it, Leslie. Come on. Stay nice and low. Stay nice and low. Make sure you have a nice squat stand. Shoulder blades are back. Squeeze those shoulder blades back together if you have to. You know, you don't want to be right here because you're taking off pressure from your glutes. Come back. Explode up. Three, two, one. Here we go, Nicole. Explode up. Perfect. Nice, Colleen. Final 10 seconds, guys. Come on, let's give it all we have. This is our final round, second round. Explode up. Nice wide stance. Keep that stance nice and wide. Toes are pointing out. Three, two, one. On our mat, make sure you switch sides. Remember, hands are straight. Here we go, in three, Two, one, and go. And we're crunching. Bringing that elbow in together with your knee. Bring them together. Here we go. Make sure those hips are forward. Push those hips forward. Here we go. Should feel it in our glutes, in our oblique. Extend and crunch. Extend and bring them together. Here we go, you got it, Nicole. Perfect, Emily, nice, Leslie. Perfect, Haley. Keep going, guys, keep going. Got 15 seconds. Let's speed it up, let's get some quick ones in. Come on, get some quick ones in. Reach and crunch, reach and crunch. Three, two, one, and relax. All right, we are moving on to section three. 
Okay, we have a drop lunge. So basically what we're gonna do is a jumping lunge, but we're gonna pause at the middle. So what it looks like is here, stop at the middle, and then go back into your lunge, okay? So in fast motion, we're here. Okay, stay low, stopping in the middle, and then going into our opposite lunge, okay? We notice that I'm staying low the whole time. Keep that tension on the glutes, okay? Then for our abs, we're gonna go onto our mats and we're gonna do scissors, okay? So scissors, we're just gonna move our feet up and down. Try to keep your back off of the mat, okay, for these. Just move in your legs straight up and down. All right, here we go, guys. Let's go into our drop lunge. In three, two, one, and go. There you go. If that's too much, guys, do a lunge, squat, lunge, okay? So if, that, if the drop is too, too much, just do a lunge, and then squat, and then lunge. Here you go, Nicole, you can do it. Lunge, meet in the middle, back to that lunge. Also in this position. Here we go. 20 more seconds. Here we go, Nicole, when you meet in the middle, try to stay low. So we're here and then explode into that lunge. Middle, explode into that lunge. Yep, good, Nicole, perfect. All right, here we go in three, two, one, relax. We're gonna go into our scissors. Here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Legs are straight. Up and down, up and down. Oh yeah. Working on the lower abs. You know, that's the hardest part to reach, hardest part to get rid of. That little pouch in the bottom. Here we go. Try to keep those shoulder blades off of the ground. Keep those legs nice and straight. Perfect, Nicole. Good, Martha. Here we go, Leslie. Try to bring those shoulder blades off the ground, Leslie. Nice, Mariella. You got it, Lynn. You got it. Keep going, team. Keep going. You got it, Keely. You got it. Come back out. Nice, Colleen. Final 10 seconds, guys. Let's battle through these final 10 seconds. All right, come on, legs nice and straight. Keep those shoulder blades off of the ground. Three, two, one. On our feet, we're going into our second round. Here we go, guys, here we go. In three, two, one, and go. We'll get it. Keep trying, guys. Just keep moving. Lunge, meet in the middle. Go back into that other foot. Back lunge. There we go, Leslie. Perfect. Nice, Nicole. Beautiful. 20 seconds. See, Nicole killing it. Perfect. There we go. Staying low, staying low. All right. Three, two, one. On our mat. Straight into our scissors. Try to keep those shoulder blades off of the ground. Squeeze that core. Keep going, nice and quick, nice and quick. We're killing it, guys, we're killing it. Don't stop, don't back off, come on. Oh yeah, we got a battle, we got a battle, come on. Back up, guys. Here 
Nice, Mirella. There you go, Nicole. Keep it going. Keep it going. Keep those legs straight. You got it, Leslie. Come on. Keep them straight. A little faster. Let's speed it up. Final few seconds. Five seconds. Three, two, one. And relax. All right. We're moving on. All right. Moving on to our uh, fourth section now. We got a uh, straight leg fire hydrant, okay? So a fire hydrant, usually you see like this, right? So usually we're just bringing our knee out like so. But we're gonna try doing it with a straight leg, okay? So we're gonna kick that leg out, we're gonna come up and down, okay? In a diagonal, okay? So if you're looking at me, in this, we're going right here. So instead of our regular fire hydrant, we're kicking that leg out nice and straight, okay? So again, we're staying on one side for one minute, when we come back to this exercise, they'll switch sides. Right, then we have side plank hip abductors. So on this one, we're gonna go into our side plank, raise those hips up, bring up forward. Our knee is gonna be supporting us and we can use this arm as well to support us. And our leg is just gonna come up and down, up and down, okay? So that is gonna be our second exercise right here. All right, let's get started guys with those single or straight leg fire hydrants. In three, two, one, and go. We are on our hands. We are bringing that leg straight up diagonally. These are fire hydrants with a straight leg. Try to keep it straight. Try to point those toes and bring it up. Squeeze the glutes. Here we go. Perfect. Nice, Martha. Nice, Leslie. Keep it in that diagonal. You don't want it straight back. You want diagonally. We're doing fire hydrants with the straight leg. So keep it diagonal, straight up. Nice, Colleen. Got it, guys. We got it. 10 more seconds. Get some few, a few more reps. Straight up. We got it. Come on. That leg as straight as possible. Three, two, one. All right, now we're gonna go to our side. Remember, like a side plank, hips are up, not touching the floor. Bring those hips forward. And then if we need, we can support with our hand right here. If not, just put it on the side. We're just bringing our leg up and down. Up and down. Perfect. If that's too easy, don't use that leg to support. Come all the way up if you feel like that's too easy. So you can, instead of using, putting your leg here to support, so just bring it out straight, have less support. So you're using more glue, more abductors. 15 seconds, guys, keep it going, keep it going. Nice, Nicole. Keep that leg straight, bring it up, all the way up, come on. A little higher, really work those hips and those glutes. Three, two, one. All right, now we're gonna go back to our fire hydrant. We're gonna switch legs, whatever leg we haven't done. Here we go, in three, two, one, and go. Go at those hands right underneath your chest. Bring that leg straight up, keep it as straight as possible. We got it. Nice, Martha. Nice, Emily. Here we go, Leslie. Perfect. Remember that time under tension. Try not to drop. Try not to drop. Keep it. Come on. Keep your leg up. You got it. Keep going. You got it, Nicole. You got it. Kick him out. Kick him out. Nice, Michelle. Perfect. Final 10 seconds, guys. Come on. Get those final reps in. Keep fighting, keep battling. Three, two, one. All right, we're gonna go into our sides. Again, switching whatever side you haven't done. That's our objector. See, we go in three, two, one, and go. There we go again, keeping that leg as straight as possible. 
Hips are up and forward, up and forward. There you go, Michelle, you got it. Nice, Nicole. Perfect, Mariella. You got it, Lynn. Here we go, bring that leg up. Hips up, perfect. Nice, Leslie. 30 more seconds, guys, 30 more seconds. We get to rest after this, come on. Finish this section up. We're killing it, guys, we're killing it. Come on, don't back off. Don't back off, this is where it counts, guys. We gotta fight through that burn. Try to fight for those reps. Final 10 seconds. Bring it up, bring it up. Three, two, one, and relax. All right, section five. All right, we got our frog single leg hip raise, okay? So we're gonna, remember, hands are gonna go straight behind us like so. We're gonna lift ourselves up. Our heels are gonna be close to our glutes. This is our starting position, okay? Then we're gonna kick one foot out. We're coming down and then bringing our hips up, okay? So again, stay on one side for one minute. This is our single leg hip raise in a frog position. Okay, number two, we got our plank, and we're gonna drop side to side. So we're gonna drop our hips one side, center, the other side, center, okay? So dropping our hips side to side. Here we go, guys, section five. Let's get in that frog position. In three, two, one, and go. Remember, we're driving off of that heel, bringing our hips down and then up. Perfect, hands are straight, arms are straight behind you. Here we go, try to bring those heels or those hips as high as you can. You're driving off that heel. There we go, perfect. Remember the closer you have that heel to your glute, the harder it's gonna be. So if you feel like it's too easy, walk that heel a little closer to the glute. We're gonna Nicole, push off your heel. Push off your heel, Nicole. Right now you're going up to your toes, onto your toes. So go push off of your heel. Yep, keep your heel. There we go. Perfect. Nice, Mariella. Here we go, Haley. Perfect. Pushing off those heels. That's how you activate the glutes, guys. All right. And relax, guys. Let's go to our plank position. And we're gonna rock side to side. Here we go in three, two, one, and go. Drop your hips, side to side. Staying on those toes, keeping that core tight. Gonna work those obliques. Drop them side to side. Here we go, again, remember to breathe. Don't hold your breath. Breathe with each rep. That's gonna help you stay in the zone. It's gonna help you get those extra reps in. Nice, Leslie, good. Side to side, nice, Nicole. You got it, Colleen, you got it. We got 15 seconds. You got it, Keely, there we go, Michelle. Keep dropping those hits. Final few seconds, get a couple more, come on, side to side. Three, two, one. All right, guys, back to our frog position. Let's go on to that other leg. Three, two, one, and go. Keep that heel close to your butt. Drive off that heel. We're coming down and up. Squeeze that glute at the top. Squeeze and down. Squeeze and down. Bring your hips up. There we go. Try to go higher each time. You got it, don't got it, you got it. There we go, try to bring your hips a little higher up. All the way up, try to straighten up that body. Yep, perfect. Nice, Martha. Here we go, Leslie, you got it. Down and up. 
Have that nice range of motion, down and up. Final 10 seconds. We got this, we got this, come on. How many more reps can you get? Five seconds. Three, two, one. Plank position. Plank position, here we go. Three, two, one, and go. We're rocking side to side. Final minute, guys, final minute, then we get to rest. Perfect, perfect. Way to have control of that body. I can see everybody's keeping that core tight, dropping that hip side to side, controlling the movement. 20 seconds, come on guys, let's get that core work in. We gotta fight through it, fight through that burn. 10 seconds. There we go, couple more guys, couple more. There we go, stay in the zone. Three, two, one, and relax. Final section team, final section. All right, so we're gonna do walking lunges. So depending on your space, okay? So what I'm gonna do here is take three steps forward, three steps back, okay? So it's gonna look like this. One, two, three, and then I'm gonna reverse it. One, two, three. So this is gonna use core work and stability when you're walking back, okay? But you're also gonna use a different part of your glute to help yourself push back, okay? So we got three forward and then three nice and controlled back, okay? If you don't have space to do three, just do two, okay? But you're gonna walk forward and back. Then our second one, we're gonna go into our plank position. Then we're gonna bring our knees in 90 degrees right here, okay? And we're on our toes. And then we're gonna do jacks. So open and close, open and close while our legs are staying 90 degrees, okay? That is our second one. Final section, guys, let's do this. Walking lunges in three, two, one, and go. Three steps forward and then reverse it. Three steps back, stay low. Three steps forward, three steps back. If we can do three steps, just do two steps, whatever you can do. If you have those bands, you can use those bands too. Your steps are going to be a little bit shorter, but you're going to have more tension on those glutes. Drop that knee, guys. Drop that knee. Want 90 degrees. And forward. Here we go. Drop that knee. Stay low. Final 10 seconds. Stay low. Come on. Control your body. Control your body. Three, two, one. All right, guys, let's go into our plank position. Remember, we're bringing our knees 90 degrees. Here we go. And we're gonna do our jacks. In three, two, one, and go. We're opening and closing, opening and closing. Keeping our legs 90 degrees. By keeping those knees 90 degrees, you're putting more tension on your quads and legs. So try to keep them 90 degrees. Watch those hips too, guys. You wanna make sure you're using your core, activating your core. Your hips should not be up in the air. Open and close, open and close. Final 10 seconds. Let's speed it up, guys. Go a little quicker. Here we go. Three, two, one. On our feet, guys. Final two minutes. Let's go back into our walking lunges. Three, two, one, and go. Two to three lunges forward, and then two to three lunges back. Dropping that knee with every single rep. Keep that core tight, shoulders back, chest up. 
Remember to breathe and to breathe. stay low. Stay low. There we go. Looking good, guys. We're looking good. Keep it up. You got it, Leslie. You got it. Come on. Big lunges. Drop that knee 90 degrees. Keep that form, guys. Keep that form. 15 seconds. You got it, Keely. You got it, Michelle. There we go, Martha. Come on. Few more, Haley. Get a couple more in. Come on. Three, two, one. Final 60 seconds. Down into our plank position. Remember, we're driving that knee, keeping those knees 90 degrees. Three, two, one, and go. Open and close. Open and close. Keep those knees 90 degrees, or those legs 90 degrees so we can feel it in our quads. Nice, Nicole. Here we go, Marilla. You got it. Nice, Lynn. Keep going, Leslie. Keep going. You got this. This is it, team. Final 20 seconds. This is it. Let's go all out. Let's burn out those quads, burn out those glutes. Finish off that core, come on. 10 seconds. Don't back off, guys, don't back off, come on. We can do it. Fight through it, fight through it. Three, two, one, and relax. Nice work, guys. Let's get some stretching now so you can stay on your mat. We're gonna get some glute stretches. All right, straighten out those legs. Deep breaths, reach for those toes. There we go, get those hamstrings. Hold it for a few seconds. All right, now we're gonna cross one leg over. Bring that knee in towards your chest. We're gonna feel that on the glute. Bring it in, bring it in. Hold it for a few seconds. And then we're gonna twist, okay? So push that knee out and then we're gonna twist outwards. Press that knee in, sorry, and then you're gonna twist outwards. Getting that lower back as well. Hold it for about three seconds. Three, two, one, and switch sides. Bring the other leg over, knee in towards your chest. Feel that glute pull. Hold it in for three seconds. Three, two, one, and twist. There we go. There. Three, two, one. All right. One more, guys. Let's come up on our feet. And then we're just going to reach down the middle. Reach down the middle. And then reach back. So just try to crawl your fingers back. Trying to get a little bit more glute and hammy stretch there. All right, guys. I'm going to read you the quote of the day, and then I'll unmute you guys. Adversity is like a strong wind. It tears away from us all but the things that cannot be torn so that we see ourselves as we really are. All right, so I'm gonna unmute you all. How we feeling? Good? Good. Good. Booty pump? Yes. Yeah. Yes, fire. All right, guys. I will see you next Thursday. Thank you so much for joining. Thank Tell you your friends to go ahead and call, okay? Yes. Yes. All right. Bye, guys. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.